nomination, best male. Best How does that feel? Human male, is that the category? It was best human, best human on male. the planet? Or in California? Planet sounds good to me. Best human male, right. Yeah, no, it's, it's uh, yeah, I'm excited. It's great. And what goes into being an actor in a video game these days? I just, I mean, in this case, it was just act as bat shit crazy as I could. Can I swear in this thing? I don't know. <laughs> okay, good. Bat shit crazy. That was what it was. I mean, the character was just so nuts that, yeah, just, I mean, having a lot of fun with it. I, you know, it depends on the project, right? Obviously. Yeah. Now. And tell us a little bit more about your character. Uh, are you familiar with the game? A little bit. A little bit? I'm not the same way. A little bit? Yeah. Uh, he's just uh, like a complete narcissist, megalomaniac freak show that just really enjoys killing people way too much. And the kind of stupid shit that we said in this game was just, I can't believe half of it made it into it. It, it was just crazy. So, I mean, did that answer your question? I don't even know if it did or not. <laughs> what didn't make it in? What, what, what went into it was just, yeah, uh, uh, just craziness. I mean, there were some lines, man, like scooping people's eyeballs out with spoons. You know, yeah. Uh, just weird shit. I mean, when we were recording it, I'm like, there's no way half this stuff is going to make it into it. And it did. I was like, all right, great. And are you a gamer yourself? Yeah, here and there. You see, the problem is, is like, I remember when Grand Theft Auto came out, and uh, I, I ended up being up like 5 o'clock in the morning playing this stupid game. And so I have to be very picky about what I spend my time doing. You know? In 2012, what was your favorite game to play? Dead Space. I like the spooky games. Yeah, I like the spooky games. Like you're the, you're the evil the kind of stuff. So you're into the dark side. Yes. The dark side. 2013, what are you most looking forward to as far as gaming? He can't ask me that. Because there's too many to choose from. I'm not that huge a gamer, honestly. I can't. I don't know. I have no clue. My friends tell me to get things, and I get them. They're like, oh, you gotta try this game. It's amazing. But I just, I don't have the fortitude to, uh, because I will. It's like, it's like having a bad drug habit. If you get involved in gaming, like that's like half your life gone. I mean, at least for me, because it's a slippery slope. Yeah. I will stay up all night playing a game, and then I feel like crap the next couple of days, going, oh, I could have been doing so much, I could have found a cure for cancer, you know, at that time. Did you, play, did you play games growing up? Yeah, but I'm old, man, so we're talking like Pong, you know, ColecoVision, do you remember Atari? Vision, Atari. Do you remember ColecoVision? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I played games, I mean, who didn't, right? Mike Tyson's Punch-Out, that was awesome.